what is up ladies and gentlemen oh my goodness i did not see this coming at all i had no hope at all for lego sets coming out for jurassic park this year at all because or any time in the future really i because they had announced all these like they had done all the announcements for this year's sets so i thought it was done but would you look at this Legends of Easily, yeah, it's probably some new Lego show. It's continuing off of that most recent, um, like, Lego short, because we see, like, this guy, like, I, it's like the nephew of Dennis Nedry or something. Yeah, I, I don't really care much about the animation. I'm not, <laughs> I'm not young enough for that. I am, however, totally up for the Lego sets that are coming out. I mean, just take a look. First off, you notice that that is not a normal Dilophosaurus, at least not in this picture. Look at that thing. It's definitely not a regular Dilophosaurus. Like, it's got one stud on the back. I don't see a seam at the neck. Like, this thing is just different. It's an entirely different dinosaur. It's got a weird-ass drone thing. But this, I'm just, I saw these pictures. I saw a picture of one of the sets. I'm like, nah, this is fake. This is some fan creation. And then I saw, it's an actual thing. And they're not based on a movie, which gives them some interesting levels of creativity. As you can see, it's like this dinosaur stand with teeth and stuff. I actually quite like that. But this right here is the most exciting. We're getting a... Ah, we're getting a Baryonyx. Oh, it's finally time. <laughs> oh. And I don't even care that it's got the Indoraptor legs. You can see the Raptor Club, but it's a Baryonyx. We finally got a Baryonyx toy from the Jurassic World line. Oh my gosh. <laughs> and these are clearly like, like this is this has got to be like a junior set. Look at this. I think a lot of these are junior sets because they're very simple builds. But they come with such great dinosaur models. And look at that fence. It it has a it's built in it has a built in way to collapse the fence. That's just awesome. <laughs> and then this right here is the crazy this is the one I saw. I'm like, this has gotta be fake. No, they are actually making a robot T-Rex set. And they're giving us a T-Rex that like completely matches classic Rexy colors too. Like from the original Jurassic Park with the more brown and gray. Oh my, I just, this is honestly the greatest news I've heard in a long time. Just this set and the Baryonyx set alone are enough to get hyped about. We get a new Triceratops. That's like what, that's like our first herbivore in like forever. And these are all like, these are, I'm pretty sure these are all junior sets. I mean, the animation is probably for, like, a junior set. Hey, we got the egg spinner from... Wait, that, that's the egg spinner from Jurassic World the game. Huh. Guess they're still taking ideas from Ludia over there. <laughs> However, cyborg dinosaurs are not something I thought I'd see. I mean, either way, I'm just really, really, <laughs> really excited to get the Baryonyx and get a new colored trike and... Oh, man, there's so much. It's so cool. I don't even know when this is coming out. I just wanted to show this off. I honestly quite like that, that build right there. But it's just new dinosaurs. A new looks like a new Dilophosaurus altogether. Like new Dilophosaurus, a Baryonyx, finally a Trike, the first herbivore we've seen in forever, and a T Rex that really comes the closest to matching Rexy's colors in the original Jurassic Park. And I guess it's a good thing I've been building this, building this um, Lost World Mobile Lab here. Because they clearly weren't working on any classic Jurassic Park sets. They were working on something else entirely. And I know that's, a, that's the classic Ford Explorer colors, but that is, that is not a Ford Explorer. <laughs> so, oh, look, there's, that, there's the kid inside of it. So he's going to build a cyborg dinosaur. This is just... So we're getting Mecha Rexy and Rexy. All right. Oh, man. I'm just so excited to get my hands on the Baryonyx and the T-Rex and the new Dilophosaurus. I'm really more interested in the dinosaurs. That's it. Nothing else here catches my interest because these are clearly all like junior sets. They're very simple. I mean, they're not. I guess junior sets are a little more simple than this, but these are still really simple builds. Very minuscule. But the dinosaur molds, the dinosaur, that Baryonyx, and that Dilophosaurus are going to be worth every penny. And I'm not going to lie, having a Mecha T Rex in the colors of the classic Jurassic Park Jeep is actually pretty rad. Well, I would have really, really, really preferred. That they make some classic Jurassic Park sets, like a whole line. I guess this is alright, as long as we get some cool dinosaurs out of it. And I'm just... Honestly, my the only thing I really wanted to see was a Baryonyx. 
now all we need is a Spinosaurus, and a Brachiosaurus, and a Parasaurolophus. And we've got, like, all the really staple Jurassic Park dinosaurs. Oh, man, I'm just so happy we got the Baryonyx. I don't even care that the set is just pretty much trash. The colors are nice, but the build is so basic. I just want this Baryonyx. I want it so badly. <laughs> oh, when are they coming out? That's actually something I should probably read. It's probably in the article. I just, I was just so dead focused on that Baryonyx, trying to figure out if that was real. It'll debut later this year, so the Lego sets are probably going to come out this year too. Well, that's good for me. That means I'm going to be getting myself a Baryonyx real, real soon. It doesn't mean they come with any of the baby raptors, though. As the dog. I'm just really happy about the T-Rex color. The colors on the T-Rex are great. The Baryonyx is awesome, even if it is going to have the Indoraptor legs. There's a new mold for the Dilophosaurus for some reason, which seems to be based off of, like, it seems like they altered, like, the old, you know the old Trudon? Like, you can see inside the leg, the, the, that little, like, bit right there. Those, like, old Trudon Legos, whatever, those little mini raptors. So it's like a Dilophosaurus, but molded to be, like, made from the little mini raptor things. Huh. Yeah. I don't know what to say. This is just really cool. The Baryonyx is fucking sweet. The drone looks really neat, and the T-Rex colors are awesome. We're getting a Triceratops, the first herbivore in a long time. This is definitely not what I would have liked to have seen, but you know what? I'll take it, because it's coming with a Baryonyx. I'm going to be getting them later this year, it seems. Yeah. <laughs> just, oh man, I'm upset that there isn't classic sets, but I'm happy we're getting a Baryonyx. It's not really, it doesn't really even out, but... It's a Baryonyx, man! <laughs>